Today, I got my hands on the mystery power box. After seeing so many people attempt to open one of these boxes and pull one of the vintage booster packs, I thought it was my turn. Now, I was able to get my hands on three of these, so we do have three opportunities. Even if we do not get a vintage pack, apparently the packs are really good in these. So far, I've seen people pull Evolving Skies, Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, some of my favorite sets, from the Sword and Shield era. This mystery box currently goes for $39.99 Canadian, which is approximately $28 US. So if you do pull Evolving Skies booster packs, it's actually quite worth it. Congratulations to last week's winner. Please email therealvenusaur at gmail.com to claim your prize. All right, so let's open these up together. So I'm gonna open it and see one by one what we're gonna get. Maybe we'll do the first one here together and see uh, all the packs of what we get. Maybe we'll get lucky and get something. I highly doubt it. I watched PokerRev, I think, open about 10 of these. I was lucky even to find these because I was looking online and they were going for about $40, no, sorry, not 40. I got it for 40. It was going for about $60 US for one of these. But uh, again, I was able to find it at uh, one of these local shops that were going for about 40. Okay, so I filled the packs, here we go. We're gonna pull them out here. Okay, so what do we got here? Let's flip it over. I was right. I told you guys there's Evolving Skies in this. There you go. We got one Evolving Skies. We got Pokemon Go. I totally forgot about Shining Fates. Baby, this is the mystery box of mystery boxes and Brilliant Stars followed up by Silver Tempest. Okay, I know we didn't pull the Neo Revolution, the Neo Destiny or whatever, <laughs> Neo Genesis Lugia pack, but you know what? I was right. They do have some super, super booster packs and it also comes with this coin, but this is a serious lineup, guys. This is a serious lineup. Honestly, so far, I'm quite happy with this mystery box. Okay, let's go. Power box, Silver Tempest. Let's start off with a Silver Tempest and get a Lugia. Imagine we pull a Lugia, that would be crazy. Okay, Black Code card, it's a good start here. Let's see here. Okay, so, so far, I mean, look, we didn't get the um, any of the vintage packs, and obviously we only opened one of these, but still, hey, okay, our first hit, and I totally forgot that I have to shuffle. Okay, I forgot that we have to shuffle these. So anyways, the point is, is that so far, so far, these boxes are actually pretty, pretty worth it. If you calculate all of this, it's roughly, it's close to that price, I mean, in, in US at least. Here we go, Brilliant Stars. Let's see what we're gonna get here. Magmar, I'm still trying to finish my Brilliant Stars Master Set as well. Again, I have pulled the majority of the rares and I totally forgot to shuffle this one as well. Okay, and that's gonna be our rare of the pack. But yeah, I have pulled the majority of the rare cards from this set, but I, I'm still missing like quite a few. Shining Fates, let's see what we're gonna get with Shining Fates. So far, like I said, this is a fantastic lineup. I'm telling you guys, fantastic lineup. Usually with mystery packs, you get some pretty, pretty crappy stuff, I'm not gonna lie, but today, looking pretty good again i didn't do the shuffle that's all right and okay we got the homo the, the homeboy the tortoise the tortoise okay time for a pokemon go pack and then we're gonna go right into that evolving skies booster pack if, if all works out well i should again keyword should be able to pull um at least three evolving skies booster packs from this set okay let's do a shuffle here we haven't done any shuffles yet Water energy, okay. Let's see what we're gonna get here with this one. This is Pokemon, this is Pokemon Go. I haven't opened a Pokemon Go pack in forever, since last year, I think, right? Okay, here we go, Bulbasaur, where's Hollow Lapras, and a Snorlax. Okay, our hits haven't been there yet, but you know what, the packs have been quite, quite good. Evolving Skies, that opened up real, real quick. And it's a green code card, so I'm gonna assume that there's nothing in this one. We're just gonna skip through this here. And I was right, nothing in the Evolving Skies pack. Okay, let's open our second mystery power box. God, I love these, I love the name, I love the shine of these packs, you know, honestly, the, not the packs, I mean the boxes. The shine of this box is incredible, honestly. Like one of my favorites so far, really one of my favorites. Look at this thing, Oof. Okay, here we go, let's open this up here. We're gonna do this one more time with the whole thing. I think there's a coin in here as well, and this time the coin, it's the same guy, it's the same boy. Which does that mean? Fusion Strike. Okay, we got some Fusion Strike. We got Evolving Skies, Silver Tempest, Shining Fates, and Astral Radiance. Again, a super, super lineup. Let's start with some Astral Radiance. This is this is honestly fantastic. So there are differences as well in the packs. It doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to get the same booster packs, but look, so far we've gotten everything that I like pretty much, more or less. I mean, I would have liked another Silver Tempest to go for another Lugia there, but we'll take it, we'll take it. Here we go. Let's see what we're gonna get with this guy. Okay, we haven't gotten any super hits yet, but okay. 
Zamazanta V, trainer, gal trainer gallery, caricature as they say. It's pretty awesome. And a milk tank. Gotta love the milkers. So we got our first hit of the day from Astral Radiance, the most unlikely pack. I didn't even think we were gonna get any Astral Radiance today. Shining Fates, here we go, Shining Fates. I just noticed that, actually we didn't get a Silver Tent. I think this one was missing the Brilliant Stars. It looks like they swapped Brilliant Stars for um, Fusion Strike with this one. I forgot to shuffle this one. Yeah, I've been opening up a whole bunch of these, um, I was gonna say Sword and Shield, but uh, Scarlet and Violet booster packs that I totally forgot that we need to do the shuffles here. Okay, here we go. Weasel, spin a rack, and okay, Professor's Research. Silver Tempest, here we go, Silver Tempest. So it's our second Silver Tempest pack of the day. Another, okay, a nice code card there. Again, this was back in the day, I'm gonna say back in the day, but literally last year, when code cards made a difference. So here we go, Psychic Energy. Just dropped the coin there. I don't know if anybody heard that. Here we go. Raichu. It's a nice looking Raichu. Um, but yeah, I, I think we're going to get a hit with this one just because of the code card. But I could be totally wrong. And I mean, yeah, it's, it's a hollow, but nothing special. Okay, we got Fusion Strike and Evolving Skies to go. We'll start off with the Fusion Strike. Um, again, I actually pulled the Gengar once from this set. Uh, and it wasn't even for me. How how awesome is that, right? Okay, we got one more of these to go. One of these ultra super power box specials. Five packs is not bad, honestly. Five packs is not bad. Here we go. And okay, no hit on that one. So evolving skies, pack number two. Could you imagine me pull like a Moonbrion on this? That would be real, unreal, unreal. Okay, here we go. Let's like shift that out of the way here. Two, three, four. Here we go. I'm trying not to look at the card here. Haven't had much luck with Evolving Skies in the, in the most recent times. I haven't opened that many packs, to be honest, but I, I, I'm almost done with mastering that set as well. Let's see if we're gonna get a hit today from the Evolving Skies. We got Flaffy and Espeon VMAX. That's not bad. It's not bad, guys. Come on, come on, give it a shout there. Espeon VMAX, this is a hit. So this is our last mystery box of the day. Again, I got three of these bad boys. Let's open this last one up together and see if we will get anything special from this guy. But I loved, again, I said, I loved these packs because they were actually well done. They look really nice, I should say. But overall, I mean, they, they've been worth it, in my honest opinion. They have totally been worth it. Okay, let's see what we're gonna get here. All of them in one shot. Here we go. Okay, always backwards, same pin, okay. We've got Fusion Strike, Evolving Sky, Silver Tempest, Shining Fates, and Astral Rage. Looks like the same lineup. It's the same lineup from the last box. So the Pokemon Go one has been swapped out for um, the Fusion Strike. And then I think there was another one, right? We had a Brilliant Stars in there as well, but that didn't get, uh, that got swapped out with, can't even remember what. But the first one was my favorite so far, but the second one had the hits actually. So really, is it my favorite? I don't know. Honestly, again, I know we didn't pull any of the mystery vintage packs from the mystery box. We didn't pull any of the vintage packs from the mystery box. But honestly, well worth it so far. Well worth it. Shining Fates, here we go. Shining the Fates. This pack looks interesting. Looks really weird actually. Let's see if we can get some Charizards. I'm pretty sure this set had a Charizard. Yeah, super rare one. Super rare. Okay, well, let's go. Fire energy, it's a good start. So yeah, uh, Shining Fates, I think I still have one ATV seal from, from that series. Set. Okay, Rowlet. Ooh, okay. That's a cool, pretty cool looking card and not my favorite. Silver Tempest, here we go. Are we gonna finish off with a bang? We've got three of my top four in this, um, in the remaining section, I should say. But uh, we're gonna see where we're gonna get here. Psychic Energy, so I know this one was a white code card. However, there is still a chance at a caricature card. Dratini, Clink, and uh, it's not gonna happen because I just looked at it and that's it for that one. Fusion Strike and Evolving Skies. Here we go, our second last pack magic. Let's get ourselves it. I prefer, if you want me to be honest with you, right now I prefer getting the Espeon because I'm trying to finish that whole Eevee Evolutions alternate art collection 
gotten pretty much all of them except that one and the Sylveon V, the one with the cupcake in her hand. I'm missing that one. I got the other Sylveon V Max, but I'm just missing the one with the cupcake. Okay, here we go. We are going through this one together and winner is... Rillaboom VMAX. It's a hit. Another hit. That's our third hit of the day. And the hits, the hits are in here. They're they're still hitting, even though they're not like the super rare cards. They're something. Let's go. We've got Evolving Skies. Last pack magic. Do we have some magic left in the tent? Well, we're about to find out. So we've got four here. Make sure we shuffle it properly. Fire energy. Okay. It's the last pack of this fun. I actually had a lot of fun with this, I'm not gonna lie. It was a really cool mystery pack. I wish I could have found some more, but you know what? At least I got my hands on a few of them. Crystal Cave and, okay, got the Hydrogen Balloon. Honestly, not a bad day. I think the biggest hit of the day was definitely the Zemazenta V caricature card. And I actually really loved these mystery boxes. Forget about the pulls, but the packs that are in these are phenomenal. Again, you're getting Evolving Skies, Fusion Strike, and for a respectable price, to be honest with you. Again, thanks everyone for watching today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, and we'll see you next time.